Most players' divots on the tour average seven iron was about four inches past the golf ball. And as the left pocket moves back, you're pulling the back of your left arm through. And that's a nice feeling for a lot of players who flip the golf club. This yeah. is him maintaining a stronger left side. There you go. Now he won't need to slide back into it to get back into his left side as much. Okay, now I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a, mind, a little mindset. Um, tweak here with the downswing, okay? The mindset should shift from trying to hit the back of the ball to trying to hit a spot up there, okay? And you know, when I swing, I have that visual, like I'm trying to actually swing to that spot. Okay? And you can see how far that low point yeah. is ahead of the ball. Now, most players' divots on the tour, average seven iron was about four inches past the golf ball, was the low point. You know, that ball was right here mm -hmm. on that little perch right there, and you can see kind of one, two, three, four. That's that low point. It's about right in there. Just the mindset of where the divot should be should help you cover it more and swing to a spot ahead of it as opposed to just trying to lift the back of the ball up in the air. Hey, divot though. Yeah. Divot, yeah. divot. It's still flippy, right? Okay, right. so watch. I'm gonna show you what you need to do. Go, go halfway back. I'm gonna get you right into the uh, set position here. Boom. More turn with the body here. Okay, ready? Now from here, if you were to open up that left hip, this handle should drive right through. That's the feeling you're looking for at impact there. Do you feel that? So here's the thing. We call it, our players call it hammering the nail. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Here's the wall right here on the inside of the left foot. Here's the turn. They're driving that handle this way. And the rotation of the body, you can see, opens up and hits the golf ball. As opposed to getting in here and just staying back and letting the club coast through like that. Let's just get in here. Let's just go halfway back, hold it, and then the feeling of driving the hammer and turning the left hip back, an uneasy feeling from the top of the swing is that you're basically taking the back of your left arm in your left pocket. And as the left pocket moves back, you're pulling the back of your left arm through. And that's a nice feeling for a lot of players who flip the golf club. Yeah. They become left arm dominant and we have a ton of success with them with the feeling like their left side pulls it through more. Halfway back, rotate through. Now, my body is turning to square up that club face. I'm not doing anything with my arms and hands to square that up. Okay, you know what's funny about that one? Straightest shot of the day, best shot of the day. And that was, a full, and that was a full swing with a shorter arm swing. Yep. Old Zoe. Okay. Watch this, hop in there again. So I'm gonna put these right here. And you're gonna try to miss those on the way down. You feel that? Hello. I, I feel that my hands Hello. away from me. I feel connected with, the, with my chest so it's not lagging behind. That was your best swing of the day right there. So when I put these two golf balls behind you here, I do this with a lot of our players. We'll, we'll put golf balls or things in strategic locations. I went about 10 inches behind the golf ball and then just a couple inches on the inside right there. And all that did was just keep you from dropping underneath and having that club hit that spot right there. Okay. Swing ahead of it though. Like when you do that, your mindset should be out there. You should be thinking like swing left and through it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Not, not, don't hit the ball. If this is six o'clock, don't keep hitting it at seven or eight o'clock. You know, hit, hit the outside of it. Let's go out to end. Try to hit that thing at five o'clock. You know, now watch what happens when we're working on setting it. We're working on turning it more connected. Look at the club come more directly down the plane. Do you see that? I do. And you can see how it has a more direct angle of attack. Look how much more square that's going to be. See how there's very little flip compared to where we were mm -hmm. through the golf ball there. You, know, you can see how much more rotated that club face is on the right there. So then yep. we're trying to come up with a feeling for you in the downswing, which is why I put the two golf balls behind the ball, just to keep you on top of it more. Right and on top of it more is more covering it. That stabilizes the face, okay? That was so good right there. You see how much straighter and more compressed these golf balls are getting with time now? It's yeah. awesome, right? Yeah. Because I, I, I don't feel this. Yeah, exactly right. Feel... It, we're going a straight line here. The club was simply 
getting used to get under here, low point here, and then raising up into it, and dependent upon turning the face over simultaneously to get it. Now the club is much more on top of it, and the face is a lot more square through the golf ball as a result of what we're doing. We're really feeling something aggressive where the back of our left arm, the back of our left pocket, as we rotate through, pull that left arm through. That's missing those two golf balls that are on the ground right here. You know, I love the drill of you getting in here like this and just, and you can see it really forces me to open up and move through the golf ball the right way. Mm. Now one of the things that you'll want to do to the top of your swing that'll make it easier, in the face on view, you'll drift off your left side. And when you drift off your left side, you have to slide back through it to get back to the golf ball, which is why you can't spend that time rotating and covering it, okay? Yeah. So get back in here again, do the exact same thing, but keep more pressure on your left foot as you turn to the top. Yes, yes, do you feel that? I do. Yeah, this is him maintaining a stronger left side. There you go, now he won't need to slide back into it to get back into his left side as much. Let's give it a try. And that was the ticket. And that was the ticket. That's the poor Zach sound off That's the, the ticket, there's the, there's the sound right there. And that was it. The little X factor there was we were doing that, but we were drifting off of our left side, yeah. which then makes you have to slide back through it. When you're sliding, your hands have to become active because nothing's rotating them to the target. What's, what's getting the club to the target when I'm sliding? My hands. Yeah. So, that being said, we need more of this. That's what keeps the club going down that plane and right, right to the golf ball. All right, well, that's only gonna happen when we have that post that we maintain a little better to the top. And that was you just keeping more pressure on your left leg as you turned. Stay over the ball. Mm -hmm. Stack until it'll be on top of your left side the whole time. That's not what we're looking for. Our chest is still, as a result of that hip bump, turning back behind the golf ball. And that's the beauty of it. The ability to go from instep to instep, boom, boom turn back and cover it without having to sway or slide. And that takes away the arms and hands extra from the body. And that allows that connection to build and the rotation to square up the face. Yeah. That's so much better. I mean, these are completely different swings though, aren't they? Uh, yeah, the, I mean, the compression is better, the distance is better, the yeah. contact, like everything. Everything, like and I'm, the divots are down the line now. They're really getting more square, I'm noticing. Not, not so in to out as before. And uh, this is thick grass, so those aren't too deep. The, the ground actually is below, you know, well below the okay. level of the grass. Though. Those are good. Right. I like seeing that because, remember, they were all thin and up into it before. Yeah. And that's where the distance is coming from, is your ball first, divot later now, not just kind of rising up and glancing it. Mm. That is so good. That was the best swing of the day right there, buddy. That means, good stuff, right? Yeah. Like, your it's got to feel your good. Your job is done here, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, that's right. Time that's, for lunch. Time for lunch. Yeah. I mean, that is such a better swing, though. Such a better swing. Everything's straight. Everything's straight. Well, my, my feel is that... A, it's almost like my chest is here when I'm swinging as opposed to like something like exactly. this. And that's exactly. the, the coverage that you're trying to get here, yes. right? Yes, yes. If I don't come off the ball, it's better. And the only way you screw it up is by losing the anchor point with the left side. That's what my mentor Todd Stone's always told me. He said, this is the anchor point of the swing. I love the way he phrased that, anchor point. Set the anchor and maintain it. It's my body that's turning. My upper body's already at the angle it needs to be to turn behind the ball. Right. There's no added effort to actually move my lower body off of it. Yeah, you're setting yourself up for success because the, the setup puts you in the position you need to be in for the most part, and you leave it alone. You don't Absolutely. think about it. Uh, yeah. And our practice plan and how we go about it and how obsessed we get with working on our golf swing, and then sometimes that, even though we're doing the right things here, can hinder our progress of scoring lower on the golf course. Yeah. The best way to score on the golf course is still to go play. You learn, but, but you learn, how, you you learn, you learn how to get the ball in the hole. But the reality is, man, if you can have a golf swing to match it and go play, yeah. and you can move it where you need to, Getting in the holes a well, now easier. you're elite. You know what I mean? Now you can do something really special. Yeah. So.